Hi, and welcome to Digital Tech Reviews and Tips. Today in this video, I'm gonna be unboxing and taking a look at the 15-inch Apple MacBook Pro Late 2018 Edition. Though it doesn't affect the look of the computer at all, for the sake of clarity, I'm just gonna let you know right up front that this is the 2.6 gigahertz, six core i7 processor version, and that I also opted to go with the 32 gigabytes of RAM upgrade. You know, these are expensive laptops, and as Apple has made them less and less upgradable, it really makes sense to pay the extra upfront in order to get that upgraded version, which will allow you to use it for a few more years down the road. Now, without further ado, let's get to the interesting part of the unboxing, the actual unboxing, and sliding off that lid, boom, there is the MacBook Pro in all of its space gray glory. Wow. As you can tell, I am a big fan of the space gray color, hence why I went with that color. But if you like the silver one, you know, Go with it, there's no difference in the computer except for that color. That's how colors work. They don't affect the performance of your laptop. So yeah, let's set that aside and take a look at the accessories. The first thing here is the USB-C charging cable. This computer only has USB-C ports, so say goodbye to your MagSafe charging cord and say hello to this. The next thing in the box is what's left over from the days when they used to ship a ton of paper and manuals with your computer. You know, most people go online for that now, so recognizing it apple really only gives you this little tiny quick start guide which if you've used a mac computer before you should just be able to be like yep i know where everything is and set that aside the next piece of paper we're going to get to here is the legal jargon and ghibli piece of blah 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 get rid of that we don't need that and then of course you get your apple stickers which yeah those are the goat put them on your forehead on your water bottle you know what to do now the final thing we're going to get in the box is the USB-C power brick now it's important to know that this is actually 87 watts, which is a ton more than your iPhone charger, which is typically only like five watts. So yeah, this is what you need to keep your 15 inch MacBook Pro charged up because it is a power hungry beast. And yeah, it needs to be fed that sweet, sweet electricity. All right, now comes the part that I always hate, which is removing that protective plastic wrap, which marks the moment when my computer will no longer uh, be fingerprint free yikes ah i hate to hate to see it happen but you know otherwise you can't really use the computer so looking at it it looks gorgeous obviously apple never ceases to you know outperform other manufacturers on how beautiful their laptops look uh, and opening it up you know they have another thing a little protection so you don't get keyboard marks on your screen right away i actually accidentally bumped mine and turned it on but we're not going to get to the setup process in this video. Uh, it's fairly straightforward, you know, just make sure you have a Wi-Fi, make sure you have some time, uh, and possibly your backup from your old computer if that's what you want to do. Overall, I think this computer is really awesome. Uh, it's going to cost you extra to upgrade all your stuff to USB-C, get maybe an adapter or two, but Overall, it's a jump that we all have to make because USB-C is really the way of the future and this computer boldly embraces it with four USB-C ports and nothing else. Thanks for watching my video, guys. If you have any other questions, please leave them down below. Uh, subscribe if you aren't already subscribed and check me out on my social media. As always, thank you for watching and peace out. Have a nice day.